My name's Sebastian Coleman. I'm a glassblower based out of Mount Vernon, Ohio. I had spent 11 years in the biotech industry doing uh, clinical research. And my dad, who was a glassblower my entire life, passed away in August of 2015. And I changed careers a month later. I went to the first outdoor art show with my parents in a pack and play when I was 18 months old. I ground my first piece of glass on that grinder uh, when I was about three years old, sitting on my dad's lap. Our glass is uh, reclaimed from one of the now defunct glass factories that was based out of Lancaster, Ohio. Um, when they went out of business, we got, oh, about four dump truck loads of the glass that's in our barn, which is the stock that I use. It's called Call It. That's the way that my dad has been blowing glass since we built this place in 1978, so I'm still using the same techniques. Once I have that cullet to mount that meltdown, I have to add four different chemicals, uh, soda ash, borax, fluorospar, and a little tiny bit of antimony oxide in specific proportions that we've developed to match that specific glass from that factory over the years. And it's just something that I've been doing ever since I was a little kid. So it's, I guess I really enjoy sort of the tradition of it and just the, uh, that knowledge that has been passed down to me, which for good or bad, doesn't really exist anywhere else, so. The glass that you can purchase is, has a much longer working time because it's um, specifically made for this use, whereas what we use was not originally intended for this, so we're making it usable to us. But in the, at the same time, it makes it, the working time of that glass a lot shorter than um, what you might find with glass that you buy from, from a company. I'm working faster and also don't have uh, any assistance, so I'm, I'm working by myself and faster. Well, I always say there's a, a family resemblance, just like if we were standing next to each other, you would know that I'm his son. Our work has a family resemblance. My name is Vicki Coleman, and I am Sebastian's mother. This is my gallery, and it involves everyone in our family. I love having it. It uh, makes me feel really good about my family. Uh, I'm very proud of all my children and what they do. Uh, Chloe, who is a photo editor. Uh, Fletcher, who uh, is getting his PhD in Asian art history. Gabe, who's a veterinarian, but he also does, makes pieces out of wood. And Sebastian, and it shows all of Sebastian's glasses in here. So uh, that's all we have in here, it's just our family. It makes me feel really, really good that Sebastian's there and continuing the glass blowing. He would be so happy if he knew Sebastian was blowing glass and in his shop. They talked about it a little bit before he passed away, but he did not imagine. I don't think that he was going to quit his job and blow glass. Doing what I'm doing now is something that I had thought about doing for quite a while. And based on, you know, life and different factors, it, it never became possible. And then after my dad passed away, I realized that if I didn't do this now, this wouldn't be here anymore. If this equipment doesn't get used, it will just, it will rust and um, deteriorate and just no longer be functional. So I guess I kind of feel like not only am I keeping this studio alive, but in that I'm keeping my dad's memory kind of alive. That's one thing I really enjoy is every day when I'm working, I just kind of feel like I am uh, get to hang out with him.